think about all of your documents and all of your items in lists as objects that each have information about them. Out of the box in SharePoint, all of your lists and libraries are going to have some pieces of metadata already. They'll all have dates when the item was created and when it was last modified, and they'll all have created by, it's a person who created the item, and a modified by, which is the last person who modified the item. So you'll have all these out of the box, but then from there, in any list or library, you can create your own. A very quick and easy way of adding a column is by clicking the little plus icon that's going to be the farthest right column. And when you click the plus, it'll prompt you with several different types of columns you can choose from. And if you don't see the type of column that you're looking for, you can click the more button. But some basic ones are single line of text, multiple lines of text, like for a description, a number field, a yes, no checkbox, a person, which would be a people picker, and a date. And there are even some more like currency and choice fields.